my god, I think he's the last one. I'm gonna get him. I think I'm Dexter. All his friends are dead, and I've pushed him to the edge. The edge is certainly not where he wants to go. Haha, <laughs> you guys are loving this? <laughs> <laughs> you happy? <laughs> You're the one I'm trying to fucking kill, but there's no fire thing down here. It's comment all there. With a comment with a time span. It's like a timestamp. It's like actually, I am happy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty alright with you. Those are the types of comments I that wish, I think I, like. I wish he was better tools. at video games. I wish he was better at video games. Dude, when Jack, when I literally, didn't keep falling in literally, the dark when, when Jack two and three come, you guys will be amazed because I've watched so many videos of like people deet because like there are like two legendarily hard missions in uh, Jack 2 and 3 that I can do pretty well. Really? So p I think I think I have the chance to impress some of our hardcore gamers out there. Is that on your uh, is that on your Tinder profile? <laughs> <laughs> that I can do pretty well. It's the way you said that. I can do them these are really fucking hard, but I can do them good. <laughs> but I get to eat it. <laughs> <laughs> so we've never explained that joke. We've just referenced it. Yeah. Uh, we, when we were first year of freshman year of college, we uh, started watching the English dub of Yu-Gi-Oh, the four kids dub, which to we kill time, which we know is a very bad dub. Um, not the voice acting job. I mean, like translation wise. Not, yeah. Yeah. They ch they change uh, so much shit that's unnecessary and kind of weird. But uh, the voice actor for Joey Wheeler is like a New Yorker. Um, and it's hilarious. And, and we, we always do it. We would always do the voice to each other. And we'd be like, hey, I play uh, ravioli. <laughs> you get to look at it, but I get to eat it. Yeah, because like, you're like saying, <laughs> saying shit in the vein of how they say it in the show. Yeah. Like, hey, <laughs> I play uh, Joey Wheeler. I go on the field and I kick the fuck out of your monster. <laughs> yeah, it's <laughs> fucking hilarious. Those were all the fucking things, right? Uh, I guess not. Is there a lone squirmy boy? I think so. Where are you? Show yourself! <laughs> you fucking dick. Is it behind me? <laughs> no, where the fuck is he? <laughs> I, I think one of my favorite ones is, Are there was, two uh, on this one? No. The, the other thing, so Joey Wheeler's, uh, his thing in the anime is that he's trying to win this contest for his blind sister Serenity yeah. to get surgery. Yeah, he needs the money to pay for his sister's surgery because she's fucking blind. And one of my favorite ones was, uh, Hey, play my sister Serenity. She gains one strength <laughs> point for every sight point she lacks. <laughs> hey. He's just spat at you. Yeah, whatever. I can't do anything about it. That's true. That's true. Where the fuck are all the fucking assholes? Uh, this would be a pretty good place to find out. Kajakuja. I play uh, Nicholas Cage. <laughs> he uh, somehow fucks a girl hotter than he is. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> I play Nicholas Cage. Oh, he so. talks about the bees. <laughs> 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 I play Ryan Gosling. I just kind of really like him, so please don't hurt him. I just want to look at him on the field. <laughs> please. I play uh, beans. <laughs> <laughs> I'm eating them. <laughs> hey, play Jack Nicholson. He makes my point in a more straightforward way than I can. All right. Who was it who did an imitation of Jack Nicholson? It was a comedian. I d I'm not going to remember who it is, though. It was Alec Baldwin. Wow, that was really just like the whole stream of consciousness right there. Alec Baldwin on that Netflix series Comedians in Cars Getting Coffee did a pretty hilarious impression of uh of Jack Nicholson. Yeah? Yeah, I liked it a lot. <laughs> Cause like he's just in a he's like in a restaurant and uh this lady like like um he says something about like some order of coffee or something like that, and she's like Oh, oh, he, he wanted like rye bread or something like that. And they were like, we actually don't have rye bread. And then like after she left, he was like, he was he just did this Jack Nicholson impression. He was just like, I'd like a slice of rye bread. <laughs> Is there going to be a problem with that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Jack Nicholson is, uh, I feel like, I feel like, um, so there, there, there was a, uh, there was an opportunity, well, like a quote unquote opportunity I had to meet Jack Nicholson where we were me and a friend were going to a Lakers game in uh in LA and um and we had I don't I don't know if he'd if our friend had heard something I have like I have those like types of little burps that are like distracting my talking you know yeah, what I'm talking yeah. about but yeah um 
Yeah, so I, I don't know if he'd heard that Jack Nicholson would be there or something like that. Also, we had courtside, te uh, courtside seats. Um... So, like, we'd heard, I, I, I think, like, a lot of L.A. celebrities get courtside season passes and stuff like that. So we were convinced that Jack Nicholson would be there. And I was thinking about it, and I was like, I don't know if I'd want to talk to Jack Nicholson. <laughs> like, like, like I, I love him. What would I say to the, to the guy who has it all? Yeah, there's that, and there's the fact that, like, I just, he's pretty fucking intimidating, man. Like, Jack like, Nicholson? Yeah, I feel like he's... I've seen him be crazy so many times. <laughs> that, like, <laughs> <laughs> how can he not be? <laughs> how, how couldn't he be? Yeah. But, um, no, we actually, uh, the celebrity that we did see was, uh, Will Ferrell. Oh, William Ferrell. I've already been here. William Ferrell. Yeah. He, uh, he just like, it, it, totally a missed opportunity because he, we were just sitting down and, uh, we were, we were on like one of the, like, so it's a rectangle, a basketball court, and we were on one of the long sides. <laughs> Just in case anyone wasn't Well, no, I mean, I guess need to describe how I was saying it. But, like, you know, we were sitting on one of the long sides, and he was sitting on one of the short sides behind the basket. You know what I mean? Yeah. So you, uh, could, so, see, you could see him, like, the whole time. Yeah, so we were looking over, and it was just like, is that... Is that Will Ferrell? <laughs> is that and, William Ferrell? And it's like, I, I think it is. I think it is. And at one point, he got up. I guess to go get like a snack or something like that. Oh my god, he eats. Yeah, <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Wacky and relatable. What? Guess what this celebrity likes to eat? Pretzels, just like every one of us. <laughs> just like all of us. We all like pretzels. Good job, Germans. <laughs> you, you fucking nailed it. <laughs> really nailed it. New face filters on Instagram. This one's my favorite. Good job, team. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, so he was just walking back from that. And at, th at this point, we weren't convinced that it was Will Ferrell yet. Y you know what I mean? Because like we mm. were looking at him from a distance. Um, but he just he just walked straight up like in front of us, and uh, it was like, yeah, that's Will Ferrell. <laughs> that's him. That is Will Ferrell. So, uh, shit. Will Ferrell epic moments. And it basically passed. And uh, I was, because from there we were like, man, what are we going to say when he walks by again? Because <laughs> it's definitely going to happen. He's going to walk by again. He's he going to see us. I don't know. It's got to it's gotta be frustrating for those type of people who can't go out in public without it being like, hey, it's Will Ferrell. Y you know what I mean? And he's like, yeah, it's fucking me. Yep, it's Will Ferrell. They're like, you were great in Anchor, man. It's like, I know I was great in Anchor. <laughs> <Thank> <laughs> like, you. I know I know. Now. I oh, know. Shit. I, was I, I was looking for a place to go. I think I found it. Boom. Nice job. I guess there's four crystals because I still didn't get the one underwater. You're right. And there's a lurker fly. Huh. Time been... to show off my amazing platforming skills. <laughs> that's what you. That's what you've been doing. Ha <laughs> Boom. You guys see that? I was wow, really man. hoping I would mess up and prove myself wrong. Good job. <laughs> Run. <laughs> Run. <laughs> Boom. I'm surprised you land on, land on the platform. <laughs> I've been sharking you guys the whole time. <laughs> I've been hamming it up for the sake of comedy. I'm actually amazing at this game. You know that episode of Fresh Prince of Did you watch the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air? I've seen a couple episodes, but did I, you see the one, I haven't seen any continuity of this show. There's did you see the one where Uncle Phil sharks those guys in pool? Um, that's like literally, It's the one that the Drake and Josh I was, episode I was about to on. say, I've seen the Drake and Josh episode where that exact thing happens. It's, it's, it's basically exactly the same. Uh, well, who... Well, it was Drake and Josh, Josh sharking them in the ser in Drake yes. and Josh, right? Well, no, it wasn't. It wasn't. It was just Josh. Drake was average at pool. Josh right. was the one who was amazing at pool. So in in the Fresh Prince, um, it's Will and Carlton, who uh, I, I think they get into like a debt or something like that. They they go and we're gambling on pool, right? Yeah. You know what I mean? And um, and they really just got themselves in deep. And Uncle Phil found out somehow, so he was like, I'll come down and I'll settle this. And like, Will and Carlton, you know, how Will's like, oh no, please, you know, because like, <laughs> Uncle Phil's just some stiff who like, he is like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Well, like, how he sees him, you, even though he's got some real G moments. But, um, so like, so he goes down into the CD place or whatever, and he goes and he's like, like, Uncle Phil goes to the guys who are like, obviously, you know, hard or whatever, and he's like, Hey, gentlemen, how would you feel about a game of pool? What the fuck is supposed to happen here? That. I'm just supposed to do it better, I guess. I guess I'm just, yeah. I guess I'm just supposed to be better at it. But yeah, they're like, 
okay, yeah, sure. How's a hundred dollars sound? And he's like, a hundred dollars? Uh, sure. Why not? You know, it sounds fair. Uh, so you know, they play like they play like three games, and he keeps betting higher and higher and higher because they just think that he's some dumb sap who like you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like he's like, oh no, this. Let's play another one. Let's play another one. You know. And then um, and then they get to the fourth one. And he's just like he's just like um. You know, I think I, I think we have to do one more game. I guess I guess I can't be okay with this. And they're like, yeah, sure, we'll take more money from you. And he says something like, I think it was like a thousand dollars, some absurdly high price amount of money. And they were like, sure, if you insist. And then uh, and then Uncle Phil's just like, all right, cool. Jeffrey, bring out Lucille. <laughs> and, like, he whips out like a pool cue, <laughs> like a custom pool cue, and he just whips their asses. It's hilarious. I love that show. Sell it come a day. Yeah, I, I think it was really good. I love Will Smith. I think yeah. he's just a dude. You, know? you also love his son. I love Jaden Smith a ton. Jaden Smith, I fucking... He's an icon. Though. I want to be Jaden Smith's friend more than I want to be your friend. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's going to make it awkward if we ever meet Jaden Smith together. <laughs> Ah! Jaden Smith will be so disappointed that I'm bad at this game. He'd be so disappointed that you'd sell out your friends. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Good job. Thanks, I just picked it up. I think, it, I think it'd be cool to meet Jaden Smith. Yeah, I what mean, if, I'm not fucking joking. What if he ever watches his channel? What if he... I don't know. Is there something fucking down here, dude? What if, what if he leaves a comment and is like, I am your friend. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I am your friend. That'd be funny. Yeah. I like like when he tweeted one day and he was just like, "I'm a member of Brockhampton now." <laughs> <laughs> like you can tell he like he discovered Brockhampton and he started listening to them a ton and he likes them, so yeah. he just tweeted, "I'm a member of Brockhampton now." I'm a member <laughs> of Brockhampton now. <laughs> Did they ever retweet him? Oh no, they're friends. Like Kevin Abstract is like friends with them now. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, I think it's the last one. Boom. Hell yeah. Nice. I'm fucking banging these out. We only need like three more. I only need, I, there's only one more in the spider cave. So oh, okay, cool. Ho can I, hopefully I can buy the other Have you gotten a lot of orbs as well? Hopefully I can buy, I can buy one from the weird nostril man. Soon to be two. You, you're gonna, you're gonna, yeah, okay. Boop.